All right, yo, what's up, guys? Irk here. Welcome back to a brand new video. It has been a long time since I've done that. I just wanted to take a second to reach out to the MC Teams community and just talk to you guys a little bit one-on-one. -on -one. You know, every time I talk to you guys, it's kind of through a pre-written message in Discord, and I just wanted to take a second to one-on-one -on -one just speak to you guys. No script, no nothing. Just talk to you guys about everything that's happened and what our plans are going forward. So before anything, I'm just going to go over the events of the last several months of the server and everything that's happened uh if you don't give a fuck about that there's a timestamp on the screen you can go ahead and just skip to that if you just want to see what's coming soon and what our plans are so let's talk about our last launch for a second map x uh i'm not going to sugarcoat it you guys were there i was there it was a disaster the server did not perform well it buckled under pressure there weren't even that many players and it still had horrible issues on it uh and i just want to talk a little bit about why that happened so map nine and the few maps before that we were with lunar on the lunar network and during that time we had moved all our code to work with theirs and long story short it was a large hassle and a very difficult task to get off of that code it was just a very large development task that we didn't really have the resources for most of our developers at the time were focused on quick drop which is what made sense for us and i was coding most of the mc team stuff myself but i'm not a full-time developer and i was also finishing college at the time so it, it was just a bit of a mess on our end before that and just a few things were forgotten that we hadn't had to set up in years uh, being under Lunar and other people that, you know, now that we were on our own again, had to be set up. And by the time we fixed it, you know, the map was kind of clipped. Okay, so fast forward past that, map is dead. Uh, we can't release another one because we've realized that we have to transfer our whole network to be from 1.7 base to a 1.8 base because we need an anti-cheat on the network, especially for quick drop, and everything needs to be on the same code base. And so that alone was a pretty big task. Again, similar reasons as before, it just we didn't have the resources. Uh, to do that. And so I spent a long time basically begging developers that I knew that could do it to, you know, get it done. And, you know, like, that's what it was. I was asking and asking and people were saying they could do it. But realistically, you know, people are busy. It's not anyone's fault. It's just we didn't have the resources. Developers that I was asking thought that they would have the time, didn't end up having the time. And, you know, time dragged on. And so what ended up happening was I ended up going to an ex-Lunar developer and we paid him most of the money that we had left from the Quick Drop MC Teams launch um, to get it done. And as of recently, we've had that done. We're still in the final testing phase right now. We're just fine tuning it at this point. So that leads us here to a place where we're about ready to launch MC Teams. I'm gonna go into our current plans in a moment. Um, but it's also been radio silence in this discord for way too long and we've done this too many times and we've lost a lot of the community's trust and, you know, rightfully so. And that's why I'm making this video. I just want to fill you guys in on everything. So what's the plan? The plan is to launch the next map of MC Teams in the month of August. You'll be able to play between the versions of 1.7 and 1.20. We're accepting all versions up to latest if everything goes according to plan. And there's also going to be other content enhancements to try to make the server better, but while keeping the same feel of the game mode that we're all simply just trying to play. Listen, we hear all you guys and we agree and we know that the future of MC Teams, if it has a larger future, is on the latest version of Minecraft. We know that this 1.8 version, 1.7 version, whatever you want to call it, is not going to grow exponentially ever again. We know that the future of MC Teams is on 1.20 or whatever version is latest and more of an SMP style. And we absolutely have that in the cards. It's just a huge technological hurdle for us to get there, right? And so it's gonna take time. And that is going to be our next focus after we launch this map of MC Teams and this season of Quick Drop. We're gonna start working on our 1.20 infrastructure so that we can make MC Teams 1.20 happen. But before that, the plan is now to launch a map of MC Teams on 1.8, the way that we've always played it. And then also to avoid going radio silent in the Discord and try to keep activity high, I do have an idea. I'm not going to talk too much about this. It's not hashed out. I've only mentioned it to Gabe a couple times, but I want to create a bit of an MC Teams event, right? So kind of like a mini game version that would only last a few hours that we can host once every few weeks where teams, you know, opt in to play. That way we can keep the Discord server active and have a reason to keep the community alive while we work on 1.20 and in between the maps on 1.8. That really is all to say right now. I just wanted to take a moment to talk to you guys one-on-one. -on -one. I haven't done this in forever. And uh, if you guys watched this far, thank you. And uh, hopefully I will see you on the coming map of MC Teams this August. Appreciate you guys. Thanks.